Welcome to Arco Linux Heftor Herbsloft Window Manager Edition. So with this one, um, all it is is basically Arco Linux Herbsloft with my dot files and a few little scripts that I've added to make life a bit easier for me and all that kind of stuff. So just like the XFCE edition, um, if we open up our terminal and we do encode folder mounts private I've already set this up and gone through it so now it should mount the folder for us there we go so we open up there we go we've got our private folder there we can put whatever we want in the private folder and then all we have to do is come back and unmount and the private folder is hidden and everything's encrypted so no one can steal your stuff and all that kind of stuff um, the only other real changes here is the polybar so I've changed the polybar to what I like and what I think looks pretty cool and if we go to a super s like that and then we bring in open up a terminal so we'll bring that in and close that up a little bit more bring up another terminal put that there bring that down uh, we can probably move that up there move this around and then we'll open up another one and bring that down and we'll resize that down to about here well that so you got your nice three terminals here and we can just go vim dot x resources so yeah so we've got the vim theme vim dot file in there as well want that on top and want that on top and yeah so it looks looks rather nice yeah so everything seems to be working out of the box um, uh, mod L should oh, I think it's no control alt L will lock the screen there we go so we're using better lock screen so that looks pretty cool and the way you change your lock screen with better lock screen is in a terminal you just type in better lock screen dash u for update and path to wallpaper ah. there there we go so path to wallpaper so you just do that and that'll go through generate your lock screen for you with the wallpaper you want to use and the lock the keybind I've got for the lock screen is dim blur you can change that there's quite a few that you can do so that's why I have a cache folder that comes with it with i3 lock so that just has all the locks uh, wallpapers to use so better lock screen works out of the box so you can use it with pixel whatever that is see it's all pixelated no oh, you can just do like just plain old blur there's quite a few so you got dim blur here so it's a little bit more dim than the original or you can just use the plain wallpaper resize pixel resize whatever that is so yeah so there's quite a few that you can choose from whichever ones you want to use and also you've got the drop down terminal out of the box well it, there's no terminal in the scratch pad but if you do uh, super D as you can see the workspace changed so now we're on the um, scratch pad workspace and we just do uh, super enter to bring in our terminal when we press super D again our terminal toggles so there we go we've got our nice little drop down terminal and that'll work on any workspace we want so uh, super tab changes workspace super shift tab changes back a workspace so there's quite a lot you can do um, this is Rofi, Rofi themed is based on Pywall so if you want to change your uh, wallpaper with Pywall you just type wall i for image and path to your wallpaper and that'll generate a new color scheme based on the wallpaper you've chosen and it'll also set your wallpaper for you 
um, but you'll have to change in the uh, where are we what am I doing hang on so let's go to sublime text <coughs> that should be on workspace 2 so I've already got this open here so I had to change the uh, adapter whatever that is the adapter name or whatever it is with um, what was originally there so the uh, networking part of it worked but what we'll do here we'll open up recent open file and we'll have to go to config herbs loft window manager and auto start so what you'll have to do if you want to change the wallpaper and use something different is change this line here alright so all you'll do is you'll comment out that line and what you want then is fair background da, 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 da. there it is so you want that script and what we'll do we'll do that fair background and so that will run that script for you and inside fair background it will be the background that you've set so so that's what you want so it's probably best to change that from the word go that way you'll always it'll always use whatever background wallpaper that you've chosen so yeah that's that everything's working out of the box everything seems to be working quite fine so yeah thanks for watching and I'll have the link to my ISO folder in the description just download the one that's our HL window manager in the name and that'll be this ISO for you. Cheers for watching.